Now, after moving the pallet out of the way to complete the storage of your new survival mule in your garage, you just grab a little piece of wood that was sitting in probably with the block and tackle, set it behind, just underneath, eyeballing, underneath the edge, and the intent of that piece of wood is to keep it from moving on the castering wheels <clears throat> as you tilt it back to vertical in that transition process. Then just move around to the crane extension on the front, hoist it up, physically, probably 50, 40 pounds, something like that, 40 or 50 pounds of weight equivalent as you're lifting up on this, and then eyeball the uh, back of the locker sitting down on that piece of wood. Because the locker is empty, it's not too heavy, I wouldn't estimate more than 50 or 60 pounds of force to put this vertical. So good shot, and you're vertical. Once it's vertical, you can move that piece of wood out of the way, and now it's moving freely on its castering wheels. Because if you don't have it loaded in there, the center of gravity is this way, it can be a little tippy, so I prefer to get these things off. Before I move it around, just slide out that axle and wheel assembly. These are good to just place up on top. Again, those weigh about 40, 50 pounds a piece. You can be a little unstable as the axle is uh, swinging around, so make sure you get it up there stable before you take your hands off. The other side, same drill. Set it up there, snowed up by the other one. And now it's time to move it right into position in your garage. Casting wheels.